<laughs> is it as nice as the filet of fish? Filet of fish! <laughs> filet of fish! <laughs> but our researcher was telling us you're an outdoorsy bloke, Alan, because you were walking Bev and Joyce in the woods. Oh, I'm, you. I got lost for an hour and a half in this <laughs> wood. Where? It was in, in Sussex. I, got, I treat the dogs on on a, on a Thursday to like you know somewhere so we so we go uh, away, <laughs> and they were and I I actually got lost for an hour and I was, seriously I was crying and everything. So how I did was, you find your way out in the end? I, I found my way to like a, a motorway. I don't know because where I started, <laughs> where I started off, it wasn't even near a motorway, and I was like this, you know, you know the kind of people that usually go quick drive on. I was like help help. And then I start. I was just crying. I was crying, and the poor girl who was doing the research chat, the phone kept going out, and it was like Blair Witch. I was going, I'm all by myself in this wood. Can you help me? So, so then it kept cutting out. The research chat for this show was yes. in the woods. Not only did she research me, she helped me. She stayed on the line. She well was giving me encouragement. Her. That's good. Carissa, thank you so much. Employee hey. of the month. Honestly, hey, it was like I was eating berries and nuts. I was milking goats. <laughs> <laughs> One show saves car. <laughs> yes. Yeah. See it. Where was that no, headline? You're OK. <laughs> well, earlier on... I don't know about Bear Grylls, <laughs> does it? I don't. Anyway, no, Bear sorry. <laughs> earlier on, we asked for your pictures. If you wanted to embarrass your kids, or kids, if you wanted to embarrass your, uh, your parents by sending in a picture of their messy bedrooms, we've had a few of them. Yeah, right? name and shame them. Go on. Um... Chloe, age three, and Jamie, age ten, this is your bedroom. You know what a mess. Sort it out. Oh, that's from Paul in Edinburgh. I presume it's your dad. Yeah, very messy. Alan. And this one. Please shame my daughter Alice into <laughs> hiding her own from Glenn. I mean, it's like an explosion that in a clothes is... recycling bag. Does is... it look shocking? It's bad, isn't it? <laughs> look at it. Uh, more of those, please, before half past seven. And kids, come on, get your messy mums and dads on telly as well, yeah, please. Yeah, definitely. Now, Alan, you're hosting a brand new sort of telethon on Channel 4 called That's Stand Up right. to Cancer next Friday. Yes. And yes. the idea came from America originally, didn't it? Yeah. Um, uh, Gwyneth Paltrow um, started it in, in America and they raised £80 million in one hour over there. Wow. I know, amazing. So she's brought it over to, uh, to England, to Great Britain, and we're doing a telethon next Friday. Brilliant. So, so, but they've got a week long of programmes, haven't they? That's got... right, yes. And then, the, and then uh, on the Friday, it's the culmination of it, and it's like one big, big extravaganza, really. Brilliant. So will there be sort of sad films as well? Oh, you know, I as know. you get on something like Comic Relief and, and yeah, Children's yeah, Media? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, when, when you want gravitas, you go to Alan Carr, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> and, um, no, I mean, I don't want people to think it's going to be, like, depressing. It's very uplifting. I'm doing an extended chatty man, and we've got Bradley Cooper, Piers Brosnan, um, Samuel L. Jackson. Cheryl Cole singing, Leona Lewis is singing, and also Brilliant. Davina is doing a £2 million drop. Ooh. I know, I know. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, so it's just going to be one big extravaganza, and it starts at 7.30, and then we're going to stay on air as long as the money's coming in. All right, OK. Uh, let's have a look at the mood. Of the no, well, we do hope you raise loads of money, Alan, because, of course, it is for a fantastic cause. And mm. weirdly, but very sadly today as well, your friend Sam is having an operation to yeah. fight cancer, isn't she? Yeah, she's having her um, voice box uh, removed because she's got cancer there, and so uh, she won't be able to talk again. So when I, when I got asked to be involved, I thought, I've got to, to do it. And... Uh, and the great thing is where well, every single penny goes to uh, the clinics who are coming up with a cure. So every single penny goes to scientists who are working, you know, to try and find a cure. Because it's an amazing yeah. statistic. It says one in three of us will at yeah. some point get mm. cancer. So this is a brilliant idea. Hopefully oh. you'll raise... And I don't know about anyone else, on. but it seems every, every week I'm finding someone who's, uh, who's got it. So, yeah. yeah. All right, so that's Channel 4, half past seven, Monday goes all the way through to the big telethon on Friday with yourself. That's right, yeah. Excellent, right. Now, a brand new, a brand new exhibition of famous Hollywood costumes is about to open at the V&A Museum in London. Yes, now we know Alan here is partial to a costume change halfway through a show. Have a look at this. <laughs> Very good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's going on there, Alan? <laughs> Please tell us. It's so liberating <laughs> being <laughs> Hilary Deeney. It is. Hilary <laughs> <laughs> But even Alan's antics pale uh, compared to the big Hollywood epics, as Angelica found out. Oh. 
Love the artist. Love Chatty Man. The only, the only thing better than Chatty Man is talking about Chatty Man to the Chatty Man. Oh. Can I get on telly again? <laughs> yes. Yeah. 15 series. <laughs> I know, I know. Well, no, 15 shows. How many it? series you done? Nine. 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 How do you know all this stuff? Oh, you read, the, you read the notes. I'm, Sorry. I put, <laughs> I put my that? foot in it Come so on. badly. You put your mouth in it, actually. I know. <laughs> well, Leona came on, and, you know, I never know. You know that showbiz kissy kissy? Oh, I'm always awkward at that. I never well. know which one to go to, and I went, thanks for coming, and I bit Leona's face. <laughs> so this is Leona Lewis. <laughs> Leona Lewis, and actually, the teeth went in. I went, oh! And there's some teeth to go in, to be honest. I know, she could have lost an eye. She could have lost an eye. I was like, ah. Did we see this on telly tonight? No, no. Oh, no, why thank not? no, I don't want that. Super slow mo. Yeah, like Hannibal Lecter. Yeah, lovely. <laughs> but uh, the girls, your, your, your show is sometimes it's like a super loose women, isn't it? Because tonight you've got Leon Ron. Oh, I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> You've got Cheryl on as well. Yeah, yeah we good, lovely good Cheryl. How did you swing that one? How did you get well, Cheryl on? The thing is, she'd been on before and she was very guarded. Yes. Say, but now she's written the book and it's all in there. I had something, you know, and she was, she's nice to see her happy and she was happy because before she was a bit like, yeah. you're going to try and get, get stuff out of me. But now she was great on top four. So she had a guard up when yeah. the jab. Yeah. That's it, yeah. like, Come on, bring it on. I tried to bite her in the face too. <laughs> have you have you read the book? Yes, I do read the book. I bet you read the books when they. So come I on. used to. <laughs> <laughs> so when I came on with my book, had you read it? No. I can't remember. <laughs> that's so insulting. You can't even remember. No, but I'm just being oh. honest. That's all. Wow. Now then, should we play the game? Yes, come on. Right, so Please. we're going to test you, basically, to see if you have read it. Now, we've got quotes... <laughs> <laughs> Taxi! <laughs> <laughs> we have got some quotes from Cheryl, my story. Yeah. And Pudsey, my auto... Da Biography. Biography. <laughs> <laughs> biography. Now, this is written by Pudsey himself. Now, we, we hear you want this book, all right, so... <laughs> So, to yeah. win Pudsey, OK, uh, yeah, which... They both, both mention Ashley, don't they? That's yeah. where it gets confusing, you see. Oh, you see? I see what you, you did see? there. Oh, no. Which book is this from? Is it from Cheryl or is it from oh, Pudsey? Oh, no, no! Here's the quote. Sure enough, the same gigantic cat was spread out on Ashley's furniture, purring contentedly as if it owned the place. It looked at me as if to say, not you again, party pooper, and snarled. That is Cheryl Cole. You think so? Because that, that big cat was at her house. It okay. sneaked in the window. All right. It is! Yay! All right, what about this? Cheryl or Pudsey? It was strange seeing Ashley and me on television. They say it puts on £10. That didn't apply to Ashley, but I look like I put away one too many. Cheryl or Pudsey? Pudsey. Oh, yeah! I know you see! He's got his whack there. Yeah, on, very good, very good. Book, do you want the Pudsey oh, book? Oh, can I? I love Pudsey, I love okay, Pudsey. So, I do, I Alan's do. back on telly tonight, you've got loads of shows. You're building up to New Year's Eve, you're staying off for Christmas New Year's Eve. Uh, is there any guests you want that you haven't had yet? Prince Harry. Oh, yes, Annas. Because? Oh, we'd have so much fun <laughs> together, <laughs> wouldn't we? Yeah. Wouldn't we? We'd have There'd so be a game of pool involved. Oh, yeah, we'll sure take our clothes way. off. All right, shame your parents, <laughs> uh, shame your kids. Keith Jagger, my 19-year-old, Rebecca's daughter. Yes, her oh. bed is in there somewhere. Oh. That's awful. Uh, we've got this from Rossi in Southampton. I came back from a weekend away to find my uni flatmate. They've done this to the kitchen. Nice. Oh. Al? My 16-year-old daughter's oh. bedroom. She <laughs> says it comforts her when it's messy. Sam Duffy. She's been burgled. Oh. Well, thanks, all our guests. Thank you, Alan. Oh. Uh, Stand Up to Cancer is on Channel 4 next. Friday night and chatty man tonight. Yeah, time. that's right. Have a wonderful weekend. Bye bye, everyone. We'll see you then. Bye. Bye.